What's up, guys? It's MB Boxing. I just finished up watching Bakadir Jalalov versus Jack Malawai, and this was an eight rounder in the heavyweight division. And this fight was Friday, June tenth, from the Turning Stone Resort and Casino in Verona, New York. And this fight was broadcasted on Showtime. And in this fight, Bakadir Jalalov was able to get a scintillating eighth round brutal knockout victory over Jack Malawai. So leading up to the stoppage, I had. Um, Jalalov winning every single round aside from one round, which had, um, him getting deducted a point. So, um, yeah, just to break down this fight, um, rounds one and two were rounds, uh, or no, rounds one, round one was really just a feel-out round for both fighters, honestly. Um, I actually took Jalalov because towards the end he showed some more aggression, was really the one dictating the pace of the fight. But then in round two, um, Jalalov was able to back up. Um, Malawai a bit, and this was actually a big, big step up for Mal or for Jalalov, considering Malawai's four no four knockout or was four no with four knockouts in his last four fights before this one, and had a very solid win over an undefeated Russian power puncher. So um, yeah, Malawai was backed up in round two. Same with round three, round four, and round five. He was just really getting beat to the punch and really just dominated. But then in round number four, um, Jalalov was deducted a point towards the end of the round because I think it was like had to do with like holding and pushing something like that. But then um, in uh, round number six, towards the end, and it was a round where Malawai looked like a bit more composed and looked a bit better in, but then right at the end there, um, I mean, the old saying is you got to protect yourself at all times. It seemed like Malawai was getting a bit more careless towards the end of that round, was really just throwing some punches just to close it out and on a good note, but then he got hit with a perfectly placed uh, straight down the pipe flush uh, and sent him back and sent him sort of face first on the canvas under the ropes. Uh, it was a very, very, very nice shot from Jalalov. Then round seven, it was a round that Jalalov did edge pretty clearly. Um, not really much happened aside from Jalalov just really outworking Molawai and landing bigger shots. And then in round number eight, Jalalov destroyed Molawai, landing a perfectly placed flush left hand, flush on the chin, knocking Molawai out flat in his back. Brutal knockout. Molawai's never been stopped. Um, this was the first time he was stopped. Um... This is a very, very good win for the Olympic gold medalist, Jalalov. So with that being said, what is next for him? In his next fight, I think he's going to step it up even more. This was already a guy who's ranked by the box record inside the top 50 uh, in Malawi. So I think in his next fight, he could take on someone um, obviously inside the top 30 in the heavyweight division. Like He could get a very, very nice, solid victory. Um over someone in there, then from there on out, it's just continuing on and moving up in the rankings and possibly fighting for a world title in the next few years. But as for Jack Malawai, losing here for the third time, I think he's going to have yet another like four-fight win streak against sort of lower-level guys. He might get called up against another big prospect like that Russian I was talking about earlier, and he might get a very solid win, or he might lose. Um, in this case, he lost, obviously, but I think he'll get, get a couple fights against lower-level opponents, then he might get called up to face like a very top prospect like this guy uh, in back of your Jalalov and like like Frank Sanchez, who he fought three years ago, and even like that Russian fighter who he did beat um, in his home country of Russia, obviously, um, by knockout. Um, so overall, back of your Jalalov destroys Jack Malawai in the eighth round of their eight-round scheduled heavyweight bout, hitting him with a perfectly placed flush straight down the pipe, sending him out flat in his back, uh, and that was the first time that Molawai was ever stopped. And uh, yeah, that's really it. I'm MB Boxing. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.